Hey everyone, I just wanted to spend a moment to share how I am seeking to redeem the time that I have during this crisis and to not waste it as Pastor Josh has been encouraging us and challenging us to do throughout this time. And I use the phrase redeeming my time because recently I was in Ephesians and Colossians and that's a phrase that Paul uses to encourage those he's writing to uh, to uh, make wise usage of their time. And so that's what I want to do. So uh, I think the biggest way the Lord is challenging me to not waste this crisis is by finding rhythms of rest. Um, like I'm sure all of you, my schedule has been basically completely restructured and I have a lot more free time. Uh, I've been telling people that I haven't had this much free time since before high school and we're talking like eight, nine, ten years ago uh, because I have a bad habit of filling my time with things. Uh, not bad things, uh, band, uh, sports, um, church activities, Bible studies, hanging out with friends, all the things, you know, uh, but I'm really bad at just resting. Um, so the Lord's really challenging me to do so. And the biggest way that I'm finding I'm able to do that is by uh, setting up structure by going to bed at the same time or around the same time, waking up at the same time, uh, getting the word around the same time. Uh, now, I have an eight to five job, so that really helps uh, fill in the day, but uh, the structure has really allowed me to, to work hard and then rest uh, hard as well. And uh, the biggest thing is just really trying to find uh, the rhythm of Sabbath. And I was first introduced to the idea of a weekly Sabbath in my theology of worship class at the university. And that was while I was a student, and it was really hard to find rest. And setting aside a whole day to rest sounded like nonsense. And so I've kind of returned to that. And um, my goal is from Saturday evening to Sunday afternoon, I, I don't do anything. I don't do any work. Um, I don't do anything that I normally do. Instead, uh, I seek to do the things that would cause me to be energized to serve the Lord for the coming week. And that's really what Dr. Hutchison challenged us to do. So I spend my time uh, reading, I spend my time watching movies, I spend my time uh, hanging out with uh, people and uh, going for runs, things like that. Those things cause me to be more energized for the week ahead. Now, I may not be physically uh, rested, uh, but my soul is rested. And so uh, that's a huge way that I've seen the Lord really press into me. And uh, the biggest question is, how can I best uh, rest in a way that causes me to be energized for the coming week? And so that's the biggest way that I've seen the Lord challenging me to redeem my time and to not waste my crisis.